hello everyone so this video is regarding recommendation uh, if you are not able to get recommendation while writing code in application dot properties file then this video is for you right now we can see that if i write something uh, i'm getting the recommendation that what i need to write further right we use this most of our time to specify where our dot gsp file is and we use this also this is embedded server anyway i'm not going to explain these things because we are not going to learn spring here so how we can do this simply uh, go on help and uh, click on this install new software and here you can select uh, you need to select from which uh, source you need to you want to download so just write sts you'll get a bunch of recommendation and you need to select this one because you can see that i have a spring tool suit 4 so here i have uh, checked the update of 4.18 after selecting we, we will get uh, some list of updates yeah and here go inside this is spring tools inside the spring tools here is a, a spring id boot microservice task click here you can see the de details written this feature provide view uh, for working with a spring boot microservice just click on this checkbox and click on next and uh, the download will get started after this just click on uh, next I'm, I'm not going to install that because I already have installed so uh, similarly uh, finish that step everything and it will take a little time if your computer is slow for me it took around I think 15 minutes yeah that's it and after that you need to do one thing and still if you are not getting not still means after installing that thing if you are not getting the recommendation then do one thing that uh, right click here and click on open with and go on go on other and search for a spring and this option it will display generic data spring yml properties click on this thing and check this checkbox for all application properties file and click on ok after this you are all set to go and but one more thing that uh, before before uh, installing uh, this software you can check whether uh, this thing is already installed on your system or not this one just uh, write write it down this name and go and search here open with then other and just search here in your laptop and if you are not able to find this name then you are good to go with this installation uh, path this installation uh, way yeah that's it thank you and if you have any doubt then please uh, let me know in the comment section i will i'll try to solve your issue thank you